Welcome to today's video, where I'll walk you through the process of creating a slow DNS server and using it on HTTP custom VPN for secure and fast browsing. Whether you're a beginner or an experienced user, this guide will simplify the steps to ensure you can set up your server and get connected with ease. Let's get started. First, open your preferred web browser and type UDP custom into the search box. Hit enter to proceed. You'll be presented with several search results, but focus on the official UDP custom website. Click on it to begin the process of creating your server. Once you're on the home page of the UDP custom website, take a look at the top right corner where you'll find a menu icon. Tap on this icon to reveal all available menus. Among these options, locate and select the slow DNS menu labeled Continue. On the next page, you will see a list of different slow DNS server locations. Choose any location by clicking on the Select Location button next to your preferred server. After selecting a location, you'll be redirected to the Account Creation Form page. Here, enter a username, password, and solve the CAPTCHA to verify you're not a bot. Once you've filled out the necessary details, click on Create Server. Your server will be created and you'll be able to copy the server details or just the specific information you need. Now that you've created your slow DNS server, the next step is to configure it on HTTP Custom VPN. If you're not familiar with this part, don't worry, I'll guide you through it. Start by opening the Google Play Store and searching for HTTP Custom VPN. In the search results, tap on the app and install it. Once the installation is complete, open the app by clicking the Open button. When the app launches, you'll be greeted by the home screen. To start configuring, first, check the slow DNS box to activate this feature. Next, enter the SSH details in the provided fields. Before you connect, there's one more step to ensure everything works smoothly. For additional slow DNS settings, tap on the plugin icon located within the app. From the menu list that appears, choose Slow DNS Setting. In these settings, enter the public key and name servers in the designated fields. Once you've entered the required information, save the settings, and return to the main screen. Finally, tap on the Connect button to start your VPN connection. To confirm that everything is working correctly and to monitor for any errors, swipe right to view the log. And that's it! You're now connected using your newly created slow DNS server on HTTP Custom VPN. Thank you for following along with this tutorial. If you found this video helpful, be sure to give it a thumbs up, share it with others who might benefit, and subscribe to the channel for more guides and tips. Let me know in the comments if you have any questions or suggestions for future videos. Happy browsing!